Hey guys, what's going on? It's Sean of Third Rail Fire, and I hope you're having a swell day today. A great day, a beautiful day, a perfectly fine day, whichever. Today, we're going to talk about Hitler. Hooray! Because what a great topic of conversation that is. No, but the, genuinely, this is actually really, really interesting. What do you get when you mix Hitler with AI? you get a weird level of understanding that maybe you didn't have before. If you look at uh, a lot of the problems that the West is going through right now, whether it be England, whether it be Germany, whether it be France, Canada, Australia, America, look at the problems that they're going through and you go, huh, man, we don't, we don't have the resources for, for all of these people. They're not integrating. They're eating the dogs. They're eating the cats. And that's not our culture. We don't want that. You say, we don't have the space. They're coming to, to some small towns. There's no space. The, where they're going in big cities, there's just no space. They're using the financial resources. They, you know, the, the migrants, the criminal illegal aliens, they come. And they're, they're, we, we, uh, we are expected to give them everything. I mean, these these are a lot of points that um, not just made on the right. These points are also made on the left. It goes beyond sort of a political thing. I mean, if you're a progressive leftist nut job, then maybe you won't make those points. But even those people in Chicago, even the south side of Chicago, they're uh, beginning to take up arms against uh, the Venezuelan gangs. So, I mean... Maybe you make those points not knowing those are the exact same points that Hitler made. And when I watch the videos and um, I hear in his voice what he said, I'm like, oh, I, I don't know how I feel. I have a, a whirlwind of emotions inside of me about it. Uh, so the, the story is Hitler's AI translated speeches go viral on TikTok with one video topping a million views in a troubling friend. So what um, some people have done here is they have taken Hitler's speeches, run it through AI, and AI has basically kept his voice, the sound of his voice, the way he pronounces words, and, and they, has just turned it into English. And so when you compare what it has, the English version to the German version, it sounds the same. It's the same voice talking, but German and English. And so growing up, I mean, Hitler's bad, right? Hitler bad, H Hitler bad. That's what we've learned in, in school. And I, I'm not saying at all that he's, he's not bad. So nobody get that thought in your head. Um, Hitler bad, right? It's, it's just very, I think, very interesting. And I want your opinion. This this is a video where I don't have a, a fully fledged thoughts on the matter. They're not they're not well thought out. I'm at this point just vomiting words into a microphone. Um, oh, I comment below. I I want definitely I want your opinions on this one. Um, also, do like, subscribe, share. Uh, Watch me on YouTube, watch me on Rumble at Third Railify, right? On Twitter at Third Railify and uh, thirdrailify.locals.com. I um, very, very soon, I hope to have my locals community um, flush with content. I've, I've, these damn kids, these damn kids are uh, keeping me from doing that. But hopefully, very, very soon. So join that. Okay. Hitler's AI translated speeches go viral on TikTok with one video topping one million views in troubling friend. Yeah, I mean, we, ha we have technology now that looks back in history and it gives us a sort of an, a brand new illuminated view, right? I've seen all the Hitler videos where he's standing and he's, he's doing all this flailing about and he's yelling but it's it's german it sounds it sounds insane it's nonsense it's just obviously he's a bad guy look at him he's shouting like a bad guy it's crazy now i covered this in my saturday night off the rails uh live stream i do on on rumble a few weeks back that this was coming out 
it had just started coming out. I think even Joe Rogan mentioned it on one of his shows, and he had a he had a similar notion about it as well that you know Hitler looked like a baddie because he was shouting. What they do now is they can translate like Hitler's speech. They've got Hitler's speeches that Hitler gave in German. And you get to see it in English and you're like, oh. The German nation does not wish its interests to be determined and controlled by any foreign nation. France to the French, England to the English, America to the Americans, and Germany to the Germans. When you see those things, you, those speeches, I thought it was all like, we gotta exterminate the Jews. Mm -hmm. That's not what he's saying. You know, nobody understood German. Well, in America, in Canada, the average non-German speaker doesn't speak German. We had no idea. But, you know, the kids nowadays, they're like, huh. We have, a, we have an interesting sort of evolving opinion on this. And I'm going to play uh, a minute or two of, of one of the, uh, the big, big uh, videos in, in, in just a moment. So uh, bear with me here. Misguided TikTokers are using AI to translate Adolf Hitler's speeches into English and racking up millions of clicks on the Under Fire platform. According to Watchdog Media Report, Media Report is uh, left wing. They're always looking out for Nazis. They're, they're always looking out for the far right. Now, here's, so, he, here's one of the interesting facets about this. It's an interesting tidbit. A lot of these people, because I earlier you, I said it's not just people on the right, but a lot of people on the left are interested in what Hitler was saying. Because, you know, if you go far, far, far right, you get into Nazis. If you go far, 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 far left, you get into Nazis, right? There's literal Nazis on both ends of the political spectrum because the political spectrum is actually a circle. And, um, you know, we are, we are at the top of the circle, at the center. And then you go on the other side of it, you get Nazis on both sides of left and right, if, if that makes sense. A lot of the people who are uh, super pro-Ukraine are Nazis. A lot of the people who are super pro-Palestine, pro-Hamas, are Nazis. You see? You see? <laughs> A lot of the people who are super anti-Jew are Nazis. I mean, you can be anti-Jew without being a Nazi, of course, obviously. But I'm just saying, there's a lot of people on the left that 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 have really developed, uh, 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 I don't know, a hatred of uh, Jewish folk, and so naturally they would go to uh, Hitler and and be interested to see what he had to say. So users have been uh, pushed and even celebrated the Nazi leader's remarks in what is an apparent violation of TikTok's guidelines that ban promoting any phrase, celebration, or sharing of manifesto or providing material support to individuals who cause serial or mass violence or promote hateful ideologies, right? And because TikTok is a leftist place, it's likely that the, the, the pro-Hamas, anti-Israel folk um, have really been causing this to grow, which is kind of interesting, I'd say. The video is of Hitler giving a speech with a slow instrumental beat that suggests the ruthless killer didn't want to spark a conflict during World War II, that he tried to save the lives of women and children and waited to attack until he had no choice, according to the Watchdog Report. And I've, I've listened to it, and it it really is that he 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 says that that he pleaded with them multiple times to to surrender and then that they're they're going to lose just please please don't make me do this i'm going to do it please don't make me and you're like wow it really humanizes him and it really causes a lot of cognitive dissonance because you know this this person isn't supposed to be human he's Supposed to be the, the 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 biggest monster that that has ever lived. Media Matters detailed other instances where Nazi themed videos proliferated throughout the social media app. Another video that was eventually pulled showed uh, cliffs by the water as another translated speech was played. 
it reportedly racked up 270,000 views, and another one had 22,700 likes, with some comments including, A.H. was a good and kind man, and this changed my views on him. <laughs> That's wild. An account with more than uh, 2,000, uh, sorry, 20,000 followers and nearly 4 million views um, had 12 videos with Hitler's speeches and outline of Hitler and texts that state growing up is realizing who the villain really was. And they're likely probably saying that the Jews were really the villain all along. Um, I, I don't, I don't support that statement. I don't condemn that statement. I don't know enough about the topic. A TikTok spokesperson said in a statement to the Post late Tuesday that the social media app already removed almost all of the videos identified in the Media Matters report for violating our community guidelines. So this was getting really, really, really big a little while ago when, when I first stumbled upon it, when Joe Rogan first stumbled upon it. Like it had started. And then it had built up to this great big thing where it was becoming like the trend on TikTok where kids were like, oh, is that what Hitler was saying? That's actually kind of reasonable. I understand now. And um, everyone was like, whoa, whoa, whoa. No, you're not supposed to agree with him. I mean, that's pretty wild, in my opinion. Along with more than uh, 1,300 pieces of related content that we removed proactively and remove the remaining others. Today, the spokesperson continued, we take a zero tolerance approach to hateful content on our platform and consistently removed more than 90% of it before it is reported to us. So now that it's being made a great big thing, uh, a massive trend, they are actually kind of gunning for it. And so this is, I mean, there, there's, there's so many of them. This one, I'm just going to play a minute because you guys probably don't want to hear Hitler talk, but I just wanted to show you like, like the videos, how the AI is, and um, you know, just a very brief snippet of, of what it was that Hitler was actually um, saying. We had to endure having millions of our fellow countrymen torn from us without their consent and without their being afforded the slightest possibility of existence. I could supplement these examples with dozens of the most cruel kind. For this reason, we ask to be spared all sentimental talk. The German nation does not wish its interests to be determined and controlled by any foreign nation, France to the French, England to the English, America to the Americans, and Germany to the Germans. We are resolved to prevent the settlement in our country of a strange people which was capable of snatching for itself all the leading positions in the land and to oust it, for it is our will to educate our own nation for these leading positions. We have hundreds of thousands of very intelligent children, of peasants and of the working classes. We shall have them educated. In fact, we have already begun, and we wish that one day they, and not the representatives of an alien race, may hold the leading positions in the state together with our educated classes. Above all, German culture, as its name alone shows, is German and not Jewish and therefore its management and care will be entrusted to members of our own nation. If the rest of the world cries out with a hypocritical mean against this barbaric expulsion from Germany of such an irreplaceable and culturally eminently valuable element, we can only be astonished at the conclusions they draw from this situation. That is shocking to me in, in, how, in how his speech is echoing in our years today if that if that makes sense like like we are we are dealing with that now sort of right we have we have people from other countries coming in and we are being told that they must have all all of the money and they must be given positions of of power and influence and and all of that um we're told that yeah they eat cats it's fine at first, at first, they weren't eating cats, but then we found them eating cats, and they're like, "Duh! Of course they eat cats. You should eat cats too." And you're like, "Whoa! That's that's not our culture. Why do we have to take this in?" Like they they came from a country. It was their country. Why are they why why are they get, getting to to come in 
illegally, right? So it's like a lot of a lot of the things that Hitler was complaining about was how how hard the world was on Germany in after the First World War. I mean, there ne- Germany was the villains in the First World War, and so there should have been something, but it was it was so heavy handed that it literally broke the country, but almost in like a cruel way. It was cruel. And so Hitler laments about the, the unnecessary cruelty that um, like the, the allied countries went out of their way to be like above and beyond cruel. And like he talks about how they for no for no reason they had a million heads of dairy cattle stripped away from them for for no reason they just weren't allowed to have it well why why be that cruel you know and uh yeah anyways this this isn't this isn't me um necessarily agreeing with hitler so get that out of your heads um i'm just saying it's it's weird that on my own i've come up with with a set with a set of beliefs and ideas all by myself that Kind of, uh, I don't want to say mesh, but you know, kind of, kind, kind of mirror a little bit of of what Hitler was saying, and I wouldn't have never have known that if if AI didn't spell it out. But it's not just me; it's a lot of people, a lot of people on the left, a lot of people on the right, hell, even a bunch of people in the middle, people in in centrists or whatever in Chicago feel literally this exact way. It is crazy. And so that is why it all had to be shut down. Anyways, I want your opinions, your thoughts, everything uh, about this. Because again, my thoughts on it aren't fully baked. They're half-baked thoughts. Um, There's a lot of uh, tumult, a lot of swirling happening inside my brain when, when, I, when I, I hear what Hitler says, but then I realize it's Hitler. A lot of cognitive dissonance uh, because Hitler's bad, but I mean, he wanted Germany for the Germans. Japan gets to be for the Japanese. Still today in 2024, Japan's for the Japanese. What the hell is happening to England, Germany, France, America, Canada, Australia? Why is the West crumbling the way the re- the the west is crumbling i don't know i don't know you probably have some uh theories put them in the comments and keep them i don't know keep them um n- nice enough that youtube won't automatically remove them anyways that's it for this strange video uh thank you so much for watching hopefully i haven't offended you <laughs> if i have i am so sorry Um, anyways, that's it. Um, I'll see you guys soon. Take care. Bye for now.